Boom. Together. We're going. We're live. Game We're on five. Twitch right now. Hello, everybody. It's the Historical Gamer once again, and today we're returning to Axis and Allies 1942 Online, a game which is currently in early access on Steam. In today's video, uh, which is the little few second bit you heard previously, um, we're actually going to be playing the multiplayer version of the game. So Axis and Allies uh, 1942 Online, as you would guess by the name, is a game that does support online multiplayer. It does support it in real time, although there are some problems with that, I think. Um, the game does have some growing pains. It is currently in early access on Steam, so there certainly is room for a lot of this to get improved. But essentially what you're going to be seeing in the video today is more or less an unadulterated cut of the online experience of playing this game. And personally, I think it might actually benefit more from a turn-based nature than a real-time nature. But nonetheless, you're going to see myself. Uh, you're also going to hear Tortuga from uh, Tortuga Power's YouTube channel uh, and from uh, the Single Malt Strategy podcast. And you're going to hear Jean, the Strategy Wargamer, uh, likewise from the Single Malt Strategy podcast, and myself all play through a turn of Axis and Allies Online. The game has some serious uh, latency issues. It has some serious uh, issues with freezing based on my experience. Uh, and I don't think that's really ready for prime time yet from an online uh, perspective. But nonetheless, we had, a, we had a good time. We played through this. And um, I think it's an interesting, fun little game. Um, but it, it also has some serious shortcomings that, that do detract from what I think could be an otherwise excellent representation of Axis and Allies. Now, this is the first time that uh, Tortuga has ever played Axis and Allies, so he has some some uh, complaints or issues that you kind of hear come up throughout the game that I think is probably normal for someone who hasn't played Axis and Allies before. Um, I think John is a little bit more positive of the experience, and I think I'm just in general frustrated with the, the way that the game is represented so far. Nonetheless, that's enough of me rambling. Let's jump back in and uh, join our stream in progress, and you can uh, hear for yourself and, and watch for yourself and, and see uh, what works, what doesn't work, and obviously leave your thoughts below. But with that being said, let's jump back in and hope you guys enjoy. There's been a lot oh of Oh my god, it's in the least. combat move. We're in the combat move. He has purchased Wait. his shit. But none of them <laughs> is the correct one. There's only a 1990. Oh, there, man, there it is. By the way, can I just. I will give you guys a bit of a spoiler just because I learned this the hard way. Don't buy industrial plants. <laughs> Why? Because they don't increase your production. All they do is allow you to spawn units in the hex you put them in. Oh, see. So I'm unless learning. you really need indust industry in a hex, don't do it. Also, okay, hold on. Let me right. go ahead. You can also only put as many units as that hex is worth. So if you have a hex and you see it's like number one, that means you can only put one unit there per turn. From like a new a new unit, if you have industrial production. Hmm. So, like, if you were to build a factory and you were to place it in Archangel, uh, Jean, you would not, you'd only be able to put one unit there per turn. Okay, I'm going to start my stream now. I'm going to do a nice little introduction. Ooh, <laughs> down with Tortuga. <laughs> Are you live yet, Tortuga? No, I thank God. <laughs> By the uh, way, for those of you who are watching, we, it took us 59 minutes to figure out how to start this thing. All right, here here we go. <clears throat> and it's not because the game is difficult. Me, 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 me. Me, 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 me. All right, I'm ready. I'm ready. I thought you were going to sing. <laughs> yeah, I'm still bum, trying bum, to bum, 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 I have, I have so to keep Germany's screen. ass on the first turn. I'm trying to... Like get the units. Just... Welcome everyone to Tortuga's stream. Probably most of you guys are going to catch you this as Tortuga's a replay. Tortuga's wet dream. <laughs> I'm going to rename the stream to "Waiting for Jean." <laughs> this is Axis and Allies. I'm joined with the historical gamer and Jean. If you are watching this live, we have died in a fiery plane crash. <laughs> what you should do is go to the historical gamer stream, and you can watch his viewpoint and mine at the same time. Oh, pincer movement! Pincer movement! Are you seeing what I'm doing? Oh my god, there's three arrows! Oh, fuck. <laughs> yeah, it's we're not exactly a secret. You literally resolve combat before I can do anything. Uh, shit. Alright, um. 
By the way, right. you need to do all your combat moves before you hit end turn. Otherwise, that's all you're going to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then the non-combat moves, like, I can't... The guys in Okay, the who's playing who? Um, uh, Historical Gamer is the evil... Uh, everything evil. It's the John historical is also evil. Gamer. Gaming and, his way uh, through Tortuga's history. Freedom and justice in America. 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 Also, if you hit WASD, it scrolls at like a micro scale. <laughs> Wait, is that just because I'm. No, it actually slows. Yeah, that scrolling in these being. Pain. The Soviets are attacking Finland. They are attacking Western Russia. Where's Sean Connery in his Russian accent? I need his <laughs> Yeah, that's right. Well, I thought we were going to do accents. I've been practicing my American one all day. Just... What was that uh, quote that Sean Connery says? Like, your best. It's what? like the best. Bring home the prom woman and screw her on the bed. Wow, you butchered that quote so bad. <laughs> <It's not even> <laughs> <good>. <laughs> that was a good quote, though. I find <laughs> Oh, man. Losers I don't try their strong, best. So. Winners take the I don't know. Winners take the prom queen home and <laughs> Come fuck on, her. I did better than you. Though. I don't know. Something like that. It's from The Rock. <laughs> At least I know the movie. One ping only. Oh, motherfucker! Can't move this. Oh. I wish I could have seen Montana. <laughs> uh. It's the historical gamer gaming his way through history. From Gettysburg to Triple Josh Street, can you link historical, gamer. historical gamers stream Twitch stream in my chat so people know? That's you can watch. Oh, you can watch Hitler you. do his thing. Whoa, 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 whoa! Just click on this link. This is Kaiserreich, <laughs> man. Kaiser Wilhelm II for life. Oh man. So territories changed. What? I think Four. I'm good. So I got that, I got that, I got that. I think these guys... One... Three... I'm, I'm choking on my beer. <laughs> cool. All right, I'm good to go. I think I'm gonna... He's gonna hit end turn. Oh, oh my god. No, Alright, let's happen? rock and roll! Combat. Current player. Jean. Jean. <clears throat> Is it Jean? Is that, am I, do I pronounce it the right way? Jean Claude Van Damme. Jean. Yeah, that's not it. <laughs> All right, Finland. Let's resolve. Oh, this. I get to watch it. Woo! Oh, this is cool. You get to... All right, that's nice. Type of combat, general combat. All right. Well, we're not playing with X-Tier G German G Street. So... Gestapo. Oh man, this is this is brutal. I do like these animations though. This is really cool. I like. Oh, he got a hit. Oh, he did that. He totally did that to you. He rolled a one. <laughs> what a fucker. <laughs> you know you gotta hit the next button. Okay. Yeah. Eat shit Fucker. there. Dude, you didn't even hit with your artillery. Gosh, what is this? World War One? <laughs> Come on. Ha ha! Fuck. Oh my gosh, that Mother is terrible. Fucker. Dude, who's playing the Russians over there? A cock son of a bitch. Wait, do I roll for you? I guess. <laughs> I'm just gonna <laughs> roll for you guys. I'm just gonna play your guys. I yeah, think I, guess I just get do. to watch. I don't it's get to roll. Like that's a little weird. Yeah, you yeah. motherfucker. Die, right, Russian that's, soldier. That's not bad. Yeah, I mean, it's just a one-to-one. He's only one. gonna get one. Wait, I do like these animations. What's though, happening? Pretty... I don't understand. Why, why did he just attack twice? Did he just. What the fuck is going on? I'm not fighting. <laughs> Wait, did I not get to attack? I'm confused. Why do I have two hits in my guys? his. Which guy he kills now? Yeah, I, oh. I choose what guy. See, I he lost. Him? You're down to two. He's down to two. It's it's fine. You're down to none after this. Yeah, I'm kind of confused is... what's going on here. Oh my gosh, please. Yeah, slap you guys. Can you just roll faster? Because this is weird. I think that you have to. What is going on? And you're counterattacking. This is your last gasp. Yeah, right it's here. just weird that I have no control over it. Yeah, a little bit. I think I got another uh, one of yours, you, right? The infantry guys. Alright, so three I didn't two. see what happened. I what lost. happened? I kicked your ass out of Finland. That's what happened. Oh. I am the winner. You got less negatives than the other person. The Russian invasion will not be given up. <sighs> Alright, so here comes the big one. I'm going to reconquer West Russia from the grips of 
the historical gamer. So wait. Oh god. <laughs> His Tolkien <laughs> regime shall not res. Uh, oh shit! This is gonna be tough. Oh fuck me! Oh fuck me! What's happening? So I, I forgot my infantry only has a roll of one. I should have thought of that. We got five of them. I mean, statistically, you should get maybe one. You're just going to probably jinx me right there. You fucking jinxed me. Well, you got two, three, three, five, six. It was almost perfect. Oh, fuck me. Mm, oh. That's not good. I have to say that, yeah, that's not good. Yeah, motherfucker. And you know what? He... Also missed all of his. <laughs> oh, good. It's weird pressing and doing it for the historical gamer. It really is. Yeah, this is bizarre. I'm just a spectator to my own army's death. <laughs> <laughs> Did I hit anything? I didn't even, wasn't even. No, no. Attention. Not yeah, a single hit? It was like hit? the worst rolls I've ever seen. <sighs> it, it looks like my RNG. <laughs> what the Come heck? on, give me. I got <sighs> one hit right there. So I'm just going to pull up three or two because. Yeah, I mean, you could probably just read a magazine while you're waiting here. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> One more Soviet troop is dead. Joy. Wait, why was... I don't... Who's rolling? This is so confusing. I am rolling. It looked like I rolled twice. Doesn't matter. Uh, this is so bizarre. Because it, it shows it as if it's my guy rolling. You guys want to know something exciting? I'm wearing... I didn't, I didn't even get one of these Wait, things. Wait, I want to know what uh, what Tortuga's wearing. Oh, it doesn't matter. It's not that important. Okay, I got two there. This is so confusing. I see the dice rolls. It's highlighting my guys, and then it puts the numbers over my guys' heads. Yeah. Shouldn't it, like, show me what my guys are rolling? Have I hit you yet? Yeah, you already yeah. killed uh, two of my Russian soldiers. Three. Okay. Three? Yeah, you started with five. Come on, tank. I actually have no idea who's firing. It doesn't make any sense. I have no idea who's attacking who. <laughs> I'm attacking Germany now. This is such a bad combat animation. It, you okay, know what? Cool. It was so better I, when I it just told guys. me what the results were. <laughs> okay, just I'm going to look at the roll log. There we go. All right. Nice. Ugh. Oh, wow. That's a lot of IPC you lost. Yeah, baby. So <sighs> come to the master. That was just dumb. Where's your... I thought we were doing those all in accents. So, I lost five units. You lost about More. eight. Nice. Is it my turn yet? No, I'm doing the non-combat moves now. Don't forget to land well, that planes. means you're up next. Landing his planes through history. Ooh. Ooh. Hmm. Interesting. Wait, the United... I'm playing China? Oh, yes. Hmm. There is no China. Uh, well, China yeah, is America. I, Trump won. Yes, obviously. <laughs> <clears throat> Turns out those uh, tariffs pay off nicely. China has become America. And then you got to remember to like land your planes after. Landing uh, your planes through history. You really have to land your planes. Yeah. It's yeah. Really so dumb. like, if you attack, like, and if then you take a new territory, you can't land a plane in that territory the same turn. Yeah. Wait, okay. the Soviet Union has a navy? What bullshit is this? <laughs> I got a sub. All right, I think I'm good with <coughs> that. Doc, comrade. Hey, look, it's Charcoal. How you doing, Charcoal? Don't, Charcoal, you get back here. Mobile is where, where'd you go? Hey, wait, is Charcoal <coughs> not a subscriber anymore? This makes me sad. What? I thought Charcoal was on my team. All you two. Why am I on the Axis? No. This is not Yeah, fun. there we go. I, it would have been way better if Sean was playing the Axis. It would have, we shouldn't have gone with the original idea. He would Evil have been Apple versus. Yeah, it would have been the better idea. There's All right, I think it's your that. turn now. I'm going to follow player, which is you. Uh, and all you. Mm, the Deutschland economy, yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm going to go over to his stream so I can watch what it's he's It's World War One, <laughs> bitches, artillery, and infantry. Let's go. Combat mo Oh, wow. You really did all your recruit. Hell yeah, I did. What did you even buy? Damn, dude. You bought seven infantry and five artillery. I said, Shit. man, it's World War One. Fuck um... me. Wait. Okay, there we go. What do I want to do here? 
Nothing. Surrender. Yeah, because that's. Really I will be sick. merciful. I will only kill all of you. That sounds... uh, are you trying to imply, <laughs> historical gamer, that it's not worth buying tanks in this game? No, I never said that. But yet, Germany, historically known for their tanks, but none of them. Mm, interesting question, yeah. <laughs> Damn, you got a lot of planes and bombers on the U.S. side here. Right. Lions and tigers and planes, oh my. Oh, you know do what? I, are you talking to me? Bring those bombers to England so we can kick the shit out of Germany and just do strat bombing. Look, man, I'm only interested in conquering South America. <laughs> it's a real life. <laughs> <laughs> Don't talk to me. Let's talk about Canada. Why is Canada not green? Uh oh, uh oh. He's on his way. He's gonna go after my uh, Leningrad. Let's Fuck. just let's just amphibiously invade. Wait, wait, wait. Where am I? Oh, okay, I put two soldiers. I am not the Allies, Tortuga or Finnish. I am just America. Gaming his way through history. So he's throwing three tanks at me, that motherfucker. And Connor or Comp Gnome, I think that Historical Gamers played the board game. And I think, Sean, have you played the board game? Uh, yeah, but I played it back in the 2000s, like early 2000s. I watched this board game once, kind of. I was playing my own board game at a at a, one of those, you know, <laughs> like weird. high school LAN party type things. I saw people playing Axis and Allies and I watched them. That's the closest I've ever come to playing. Really? Yeah. Watching so, his his heard, the, the only experience you have with Axis and Allies is you watch somebody else play momentarily. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And then I already knew about Hearts of Iron 2 by the okay. time I was asked to play uh, that. And I was like, no, that sounds like Risk, but I don't like Risk anymore. So, Too cool for Risk. The story of Tortuga. Okay, you play enough games of Risk and you realize that it is the worst game ever invented. Whoa! Maybe. He just lost half his stream right there. <laughs> I mean, it's it's actually, okay, I would put it this way. I don't the mean worst, worst game, game as in ever invented or anything seems like that. A I mean, bit it's aggressive. the most likely to start a real fight. <laughs> that might be true. <laughs> it's just like everyone hates each other for days after a game of Risk, and then you're just like, why do I play this? Everyone just hates each other. It's like, why do I play this? Because it's stupid. I'm going to, uh, I'm going to, like, channel my Kramer is like Ukraine is weak it's like what you talk about I am from Ukraine Ukraine not weak you remember that Seinfeld episode nope oh shit America good story I'm John. my American accent <laughs> you were playing you were playing uh, Risk Kurz Light Kurz Light pass me Kurz Light you know the weird thing America. is I did see somebody in the subway in the MTA in New York City actually playing not Risk but a board game I think it was Monopoly in the subway. Subwaying uh, his way yeah, through history. Monopoly is also one of those games I think is also a bit overrated. Ooh. I really like it, but it's also one of those that gets everyone to hate each other. He's throwing yeah. down the overrated terms. That's probably because you always lose. <laughs> All right, well, look at any game where it's just 100% based on RNG. Uh, let's just roll dice in five seconds and see who wins. Why take three hours to do that? I mean, that's kind of access and allies. <laughs> yeah, that's why. I, that's what I, I think. Access, access and allies has slightly more strategy. The more strategy, the better, in my opinion. So, fucking toward uh, historical gamer is fucking throwing everything he has. I can't believe we're fucking, still on Germany's turn. Yeah, this what is not is a fast on? game. Let's just be honest. Um, so we're gonna do. This. Why can't? Why can't? Why Field of Glory Empires? Why can't Field of Glory Empires be like this? Why can't this be Wego? <gasps> they should make Axis and Allies the Wego version. All right, here we go. First things first. Let's watch. Oh, wait, no, that reminds me of the American Airlines, like, security briefing. <laughs> first things first. Let's buckle those belts. Sorry. <laughs> just, just was on an American oh, Airlines fucker. flight the other day. Hey, that was this easy. Be easier to fucking take at less. Mm, this has got to be a better. I lost the whole fucking. Wait, wait, you didn't get a chance to defend? No, he did. Oh. He just missed. Oh. Oh, did I? Yeah, you shot and missed. You got a six. <laughs> nice try. Motherfucker. It, it got to be a little bit more difficult to take out ships, because ships take so much. 
IPCs to build and they're so easy to destroy. Why is there no pre-combat? Like, what, what is going on Surprise here? Surprise, strike. a strike. Mm. Yeah, I want to see the die roll log because I, I don't... I cannot follow the die roll animations. One hit on not. the uh, on the bat. Yeah, the die roll animations are really bad. Oh shit! Hey, let me turn off the. Oh animations. no! Well, you're gonna get Maybe one shot help. back. We'll see what he does with his battleship. Here comes the roll. He missed. He missed with his battleship. Press the attack. He did. What the hell? He did. By the way, I think if I kill you with my sub, you don't get to counterattack. Dead. Fucker. Yep. And Son of a bitch! So you lose hey, a merchant look, ship. UK, and... you gotta stop sucking. Why you lost twenty seven IPC? You lost a battleship and a transport. Oh what my fucker. gosh, you just got destroyed. You do the same thing the AI does. They knock out the English fleet on the first turn. I don't even get to play. RIP uh hood. RIP. Yeah, they make <laughs> the British Navy pretty fucking weak in this game. <laughs> just like, oh, the Germans could have won so easily. Surprise yeah, they, attack. Yeah, the English hey, game. I got a hit. Nice. And there goes that. You Wait, that was a party for submarines? Submarines kill submarines in this game? Booyah. It happened in real what? life, like, twice. <laughs> 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 oh, shit. So now Germany controls the seas, I see. Yeah. Let's see how this goes. Eat it. Rip to the Eat Royal it. Navy. Well, it's not royal anymore. <laughs> royal it's on the bottom, of the, bottom of the ocean. Oh, uh, here we go. The Russian Wait, front. Oh my gosh. Oh, Duga, I need your help. Karelia. You gotta get across that motherfucking sea. You no, some... man, I told you, we're going after South of Africa. Oh, my maybe. infantry suck. What a South surprise. America. <laughs> There's oh. no one in South America. Motherfucker! I only got a single hit. Why are you so pissed? Because that's half my army. <laughs> uh, I try a third, but okay. Or no, is it? Yeah, yeah, that's a third. There you go. You got one hit with your fighter there. I don't understand why fighters are four on the defensive. That seems ridiculous. Yeah, I really don't understand anything about the combat, but that, I suppose that's based on the board Ooh, game. Oh, right? nice. I got a one. Snake eyes. Kind of like the that movie with, what's his name? Who's that guy that's the actor that's unemployed? All of your troops are dead. Oh, you killed me already? He dead. All right, I'll take a hit on the infantry. Seabass says allies get stronger over time. You just need to hold your ground. Hey, um, how about you just hold your ground? Holy cow, you are losing. Yeah, well, I lost a shit ton of men on the first turn. I, I think you lost less total than he lost in the first naval battle. Yeah, the allies get stronger over time because they have so they have a lot more economy. Oh nice. my fucking believable! Infantry rolls a one. All right, that was better at least. Not bad. Well, there goes my army. That's not bad. Did he, wait, did he land three hits? Oh, I don't think a, so. You got one. I got two He has hits. a tank left still. Yeah, good. You did well. It's not over yet. But it pretty much is. Yeah, <laughs> a little bit. Okay, now you can counterattack. He counterattacked and took out two infantry. Yeah, I gotta admit that All right, there I you go. on your side, it's much more uh, fluid in terms of what's going on. On mine, it's kind of skipping a lot. I lost yeah, more I turn off the dice like. animations. It makes a lot more sense. Uh, Did point. it just freeze on me? These oh, results. there it goes. It just like decided it was going to take a long fucking time. Whatever. Yeah, man. I took more casualties than Another you Another German victory on the Russian front. You could do your Italian accent. I guess it also is appropriate. I don't know how to do an Italian accent. Kidding. How does this game work anyway? Uh, no one uh, knows. Mm, I'm not even going to try to explain it. <laughs> <laughs> it's World War II. A hmm. little bit of Kermit the Frog there. Hmm. All right. Um, Non-combatant move. <sighs> is that it almost my turn? Yeah, well, actually, no, it's almost John's next turn. Then it's going to be my turn. Then it's going to be your turn. <laughs> I don't like this. I don't like this game. You're last on the list. You might as well I, just like, go on and take a America nap. America is last. I'm switch, switching over to my other recording screen. If you want, you can take over. Well, you can't take over. I would love if the game you can, like, switch I should players, just be like, able hey, to, like, multi-click. I shouldn't have to. Oh, freaking... my God. 
Maybe I can multi-click and I'm just clicking off this for no reason. Let's try this. Oh, that does work. That's so much better. Oh, I should be playing RimWorld in the background. <laughs> I'm waiting. <laughs> It's gonna take Waiting forever. his way through history. Giddy up. I'm moving pretty quick. Uh, is that everything? Do I want to move anything else? I don't even know if I can move anything. What's your guys' position on them going. using the, I would say, artificial German... I'm not to say artificial, but like, the, the not the Nazi symbol on Germany in here. Yeah, I know they use they use the Iron Cross. That's fine. It's an appropriate it's one. Like one that everybody uses in every game. Whatever. Yeah. Mobilization. We're calling up the reserves. <laughs> Sir, no? it's not World War One anymore. Why did you buy so much artillery and infantry? Because World War One was the best World War. <laughs> I just don't understand. That was not ten units. Why right? is your Turn not over. It won't let me place these units. What the fuck? Oh, uh, if you kind of go to, like, uh, each factory can only uh, allow you to have so many units. That's why in no, Lenin... I know that, but I had I haven't even placed ten units yet. No, I. I well, think... okay. Is the the light gray number is the production value, and the dark yellow, black, and yellow number is the how many? No, wait. How do you know how many... It's frozen on this? me again. Like, it won't even let me place in Italy, where I haven't placed anything. All right, so I'm looking at the U.S. here, and I have 10, 6, and 12. But where... How many troops can I put down in each one of those? Oh, now it unfroze. Good job, sir. <clears throat> this is after the patch. The game was just patched, right? It's fixed. Yeah. All right, there you go, John. I gain yeah, two dude. territories, I gain four national production, and I get 42 IPCs. Fucking motherfucker. I wish supply was a thing, otherwise your army in Finland would be fucked. But someone should tell uh, should tell the Germans that Leningrad was really easy to take. <laughs> you control the seas now. That's nice. It's the historical yes. gamer. Rewriting history. Okay, so I don't understand why does what what is up with the Royal Navy in this game? <laughs> it's Tortuga, not possible. Tortuga, what navy? Would Germany just eliminate the Royal Navy? No, they still got one more cruiser. <laughs> I think that might actually be the Canadian Navy, though. I can't, I can't believe it. I, I wasn't really paying attention. I saw Jean take a lot of losses, but. <laughs> <laughs> I love that you're just gacking out of the fact that I just wiped out the Royal Navy in one turn without even trying. Okay, the, the, no game. This game loses all credibility with me. If you can eliminate the Royal Navy as Germany in one turn. <laughs> yeah. By the way, it's your turn now, right, John? Yeah, I'm uh, going to the thing. <laughs> yeah. What the hell? Okay, I, like, I'm, it's just not that funny. I it's told just, you, for conferences, they have a, a different version of the game that strengthens England and weakens Germany. <laughs> Which we have the option of playing as, but we chose not to because... This is the classic, this is the Hasbro... Because it's struggle game or new. <laughs> no, this is the version of the game that <laughs> shipped in the board game boxes. Like, wait, 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 where is the United States Navy? What Navy? It's, uh, I, think I have one aircraft carrier, one destroyer, and one submarine, and one cruiser. You've got a destroyer off the west east coast, it looks like. You've got a battleship and a destroyer off the west coast. Um, and you've got a carrier and a submarine and a destroyer and a battleship in the south pacific. Okay, so you have a cruiser and two submarines. And then, what is that, a cruiser in the Mediterranean? Uh, the Germans? Yeah. Yeah, I've got a cruiser in the Mediterranean. So you have more cruisers than the United States does. Makes sense. Germany obviously had more cruisers than the United States did. Mm. <laughs> you were Let me able go back to into my war in the Navy. Pacific and see how easy it was for the Americans to just... <laughs> well, wait, the Germans aren't there. Never mind. That's amazing. That's seriously amazing. Uh, the game, I don't know. I mean, it's obviously got to do its own thing for balancing, but... Hey, man, this is one Navy of the all-time be... classics. Yeah, oh man, it's just nuts. It's too it's just too nuts for me. It's like too fictitious. 
All right, everybody, that's going to do it for the first part of our online multiplayer game of Axis and Allies with XTRG, Tortuga, and myself. Uh, this is a first look at multiplayer in Axis and Allies 1942 online. And I think from a real-time perspective, in all honesty, I don't say this very often with games, but I do think this game would benefit much more from a uh, play-by-email mechanic than a real-time mechanic. You can see we're 30 minutes in, and we've only gotten through two countries' turns. And, um, you know, this is there's been a few things I've cut out, a couple of seconds here and there, but in general, this is a, this is a real cut. This is a real take. This is watching what your experience would be like. And I can't imagine there's going to be a lot of times where you're going to have, literally, we end up playing uh, the first turn for about an hour and a half before we even get through it. And, um, you know, there's not going to be a lot of times that you have that much time to play through it. Overall, a lot of the mechanics and the gameplay and the visuals and whatever is an authentic recreation of Axis and Allies. There's just some limitations that I think would be better uh, avoided. With that being said, we will present further iterations of this series, which I think was a lot of fun to play. And I think you can hear uh, in our voices that we really are enjoying uh, having, uh, playing this together. And I think you can hear from Tortuga's perspective while, uh, you know, he's gacking out about, uh, or just laughing about, um, you know, the Royal Navy, uh, that we did enjoy our time with this. Uh, but you know, there's some limitations from a stability perspective. Even after this patch that came out, we had some issues where uh, on two occasions, the game actually froze on me. I cut part of one of them down a little bit, but uh, you could even see with the production, uh, the production issue where the game kind of froze on me for a bit. But anyway, guys, that's enough of me rambling. Hope you're enjoying. Let me know your thoughts below. And until next time, this is the Historical Gamer saying thank you for watching. And until next time, we're out.